Welcome to Routing and Switching. We are doing Lab 3.2.4.8, Troubleshooting a VLAN Implementation, Scenario 2. So we have a few problems we're going to be looking at. So let's go ahead and let's hop directly into the switch so we can see what's going on. So the first thing I want to do is I want to go to our user exec mode. I want to show VLAN to see what VLANs I'm dealing with. So I'm dealing with VLANs 10, 20, 30, and 56. 56 is for management and native. Okay, so 10 is for 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So this one is shown 11 is on VLAN 10. 20 is ports 18 through 24. So that's going to be on VLAN 20. VLAN 30 is showing ports 1 through 5. So I'm sorry. VLAN 30 is showing 6 through 10. VLAN 56 is showing VLANs 1 through 5. First thing I notice automatically. I'm getting a mismatch uh, for our native VLAN, so there's something going on there. So let's go ahead and let's do one more show command. Just show interface trunk. Let's see where our trunks are. Right now, there are no trunks. So let's go ahead and on switch to, let's fix that. So configure terminal, hop over to the gig. Uh, Interface at so gig zero slash one switch port mode trunk. So let's go back to our user exec mode. The show interface trunk. All right, there we go. We show our gig zero one port now uh, appropriate. So we're using native VLAN 56. We're getting a, a mismatch a error, so something is going on with inappropriate native VLANs. Let's go ahead and hop over to switch three so we can do the same commands. Let's go to our user exec mode. Show VLANs. Let's double check. All right, so first thing I notice is PCs are not assigned, or sorry, ports are not assigned to the appropriate VLAN. So let's go ahead and fix that first. Let's hop into our global configuration mode. Let's navigate to first interface, FA0 slash 11. Let's change that to switch port access. That is supposed to be VLAN 10. Let's go navigate to the FA0 slash 18 interface. That's switch port access VLAN, and that's supposed to be VLAN 20. Oh. Switch port. Access VLAN 20. Gotta be careful, Pat, fingering this. Last port, let's go ahead and look at our interface FA0 slash 6. This should be switch port access VLAN 30. Let's go back to our user exec mode and let's double check. Show VLAN. So there are the three ports that we are using. You may need to actually configure the uh, the VLAN the same way on switch two, so that way all of the ports are broken down into the appropriate VLANs. So keep that in mind. Native uh, management VLAN show no ports. So lastly, let's do a show 
Interface trunk. Gig 2 is our connection. It's on. It's in the correct encapsulation. It's trunking. And it's using native VLAN 56. So, switch 3 looks good. Let's hop over to switch 1. We're going to get a lot of mismatch uh, VLANs here. Let's look, hop over to our user exec mode. Let's do a show VLAN. Let's look at VLANs first. All of them are using the appropriate VLAN right now on switch 1. There are no uh, VLANs. Show int trunk. So gig 1 and gig 2 are on using the appropriate encapsulation using trunking but are the wrong native VLAN. So let's go ahead and hop into our global configuration mode so we can fix that. Configure terminal. Let's go ahead and look at the int range g0-1 through 2. You have to do g0-1 space hyphen space 2. That seems to be the way that it works best. Oh. Helps if I also spell, uh, spell int correctly. And we are going to do a switch port mode. Sorry, switch port trunk native 56. So we want to change that to the VLAN 56. So now you're going to start showing some inconsistent uh, port rest restorations. Let's go and let's double check our show interface trunk so we can make sure that our native VLAN is set to 56. And we should be good with this lab. I want to thank you guys. I hope you guys have a great day.